Welcome to the Parenting Roundabout Speed Round, where we answer a quick question every day to keep our group chat fun going all week long. Recently, I had to renew the earthquake insurance <laughs> on my house because I live in Southern California. Yeah. And there usually isn't a week that goes by without some kind of tremble under our feet. <laughs> so wow. I have to say that earthquakes are on the top of my mind when I think about yeah. things that could go wrong in this area. And uh, so I'm wondering um, what type of natural disasters are you exposed to in your geographical locations or that you worry about that could potentially happen? Um, I don't think you have to get earthquake insurance, but is there anything else that you need to think about, <laughs> Catherine? You know, we're pretty lucky here. We could get tornadoes um, and we could get, obviously, blizzards, but um, but that's kind of it. I mean, we're, not, we're certainly not going to get a hurricane. Um, <laughs> we're about as landlocked as you could be. Uh, so, yeah, we're pretty... We're pretty lucky here. Um, and even like a big, heavy snowfall, um, it, it, you know, everyone's prepared for it. Yeah, so right. it's, it's, we're able to handle it. Um, and, you know, there might occasionally be like flash floods or things like that. But where I live is pretty, it's pretty good. Knock right. on wood. <laughs> <laughs> what about forest fires? Do you ever get forest fires in your area? Because that's another thing we yeah. worry about, Dan. No, I mean, I don't, we don't have a lot of like woods right here where we are. It would be a little further away, like further north where they do have timber industry, you know. Okay. Um, but not really where, because I'm kind of in the suburbs. <laughs> wow. We're all moving to Catherine's neighborhood. Yeah. As Although, as Terry, take... what do you get over there in New Jersey? <laughs> <laughs> well, we're in hurricane country. Definitely. Oh. And we are also even more debilitating. We are in hurricane hysteria country. So, <laughs> you know, once the Weather Channel starts talking something up out in the ocean somewhere, you know, people start stocking up on dry goods and, and canceling things and, you know, talking about how bad it's going to be and firing up their generators. And so it's, you know, we've had a few since I've lived here. We've definitely had a few big damaging ones. But We've had way, way more hysteria over nothing at all ones. So that's the So thing. can you get hurricane insurance? Is that a thing? Well, you could get flood insurance. I don't know if there's oh, okay. hurricane insurance or not. The first house we lived here, the basement flooded anytime it rained hard, especially in the winter when the ground wasn't absorbing stuff very well. Uh, yeah. But we didn't have to have flood insurance for that house. We moved to the house we're in now, and it supposedly was in some sort of flood zone, and we were supposed to get flood insurance. We've never had water in the house here at all so stuff is zoned in a certain way but they they had built a, a drainage area and so it doesn't flood here anymore so that is flooding is is a thing uh, yeah. but um i don't know i don't think i've ever seen hurricane insurance it may exist especially for people who live down the shore but um it's uh you know and there's snow but it's not terrible i i grew up in earthquake and forest fire country and yes. uh and spent a little time in tornado country uh, and uh, was always amazed at the alerts in the bottom of the TV screen warning you about things coming and mm -hmm. suggesting that you might want to go to your downstairs neighbor and get in their bathtub and put a mattress over yourself. Um, <laughs> but uh, I always liked earth, earth, earthquakes seemed preferable because there's no warning. You know, it happens and you deal with it. You don't have the 48 hours of anxiety. Beforehand. Anticipation <laughs> is freaking out. <laughs> uh, yeah. And these days, sadly enough... I, People obviously who have grown up here and lived here all their lives are just so used to it. They carry on with their day. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. As did as did I was in a few yeah. when I was little, a few big ones. Yeah. Uh, and it was it was trippy. But, Interesting. Uh, well, be thankful you don't live in earthquake country because my earthquake insurance is two thousand dollars a year. So yeah. On that note. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for today's speed round. Come back tomorrow for another question and visit parentingroundabout.com for all our group chats and other weekly episodes.